Hello, my little morsels. It's me, Paul McGoblin, playing Minecraft Skyblock. I know I've been playing a lot of this lately, but you know, I love it. Ooh, we got a spider in our area. Let's go kill it now, shall we? Yes. All right. Uh, where are you over there, spider? Give me your spider silk. You are in my mega tree. What are you doing in my mega tree? Giving me nothing but a cool. There's a silk. I have another mega tree, which we are going to mine out. I've just mined out that tree in hopes that there's some apples. I'm not really hungry, but it's always nice for more food. All right. And, oh, this is our fishing pond. I'll show you what we're going to do there. And um, there's another spider out there. I think I want to go dispatch it. Oh, look at all this stuff out here. Ha ha, give me your stuff. Hey there, spider. How you doing? Oh, don't fall off. Yeah, thank you for your silk. Oh, no, 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 no. How did you, where'd you guys? Oh, that's bad news. Uh, that may not be good. Luckily, I have some wood with me. We would have been up a creek if I didn't have materials with me. I guess I could make that jump, but I don't want to. Oh, creeper, don't mess with me. Come on. <laughs> Stuck outside. All right. So, uh, let's get down the brass tacks. We are going to make a fishing pole. I need one, two, three sticks and two strings, which I got from just killing those spiders out there. So let's get our three sticks, our two strings, and viola. Oh, a fishing pole. All right, and then we're going to take our handy-dandy fishing pole over here to this beautiful lake that we have created. And uh, plop in a line. Now, uh, there should be some bubbles that'll appear in the water and kind of move towards the, the bobber out there. And then I just yank in my, my line and there'll be a fish on the end of it or a boot or uh, another fish. And I'll sit, look, there's the bubbles. They're starting to percolate. But you can catch all sorts of stuff. I've caught crap. I've caught fish. I've caught... Uh, um, blowfish, which are used for, uh, for alchemy. Right now, I seem to be catching a cold. So, oh, there we go. Ah, oh, silly. Holmec was a horrible, horrible shot at getting my fish. Come on. All right, maybe it's because I have to be quiet and I'm sitting here yapping away about fishing. And the fish can hear me. I really doubt that's the case. But here we go. Alright. It's all quiet. You can hear the birds chirping. The wonderful water is open. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, see, I caught a uh, blowfish. Now, that's no good for me. Because I want fish that I can eat. Um, not fish for alchemy. Because I'm not planning on building a... Uh, a... Uh, alchemy cauldron anytime soon but a nice fish that I could throw into my forge and cook oh I haven't shown you my forge I will show you my forge uh, most of my off off camera time I've spent uh, turning cobble into wood um, now that we don't have lava stupid goblin um, I have to conserve yeah there's a fish I have to conserve my my cobblestone, so any place that I can make it wood, I have been. I've got about a, a stack of cobble in my chest over there. But uh, this fishing pond is going to help me out immensely. It's going to give me another food source. Look, we just caught two fish. Come back, Ryan. I don't want you anymore. Let's get into our... Uh, I made some charcoal, and you can do that by burning 
like a oak wood uh, tree stump, not the planks, but the stump itself. And it'll turn into a piece of charcoal for you guys that are just starting Minecraft. But look, throw my raw fish in there. We're going to have some salmon, I think, tonight. Mm, yeah, salmon. Yum, yum, yum. All right, now I take out my cooked fish. Achievement get delicious fish. So, excellent news. No achievement for the salmon. Apparently, they don't think salmon is delicious fish, but I do. So, I'm going to eat it. Yum. Very good. And it raised my hunger all the way up to full, so my heart should come back. Look, there's an apple. Let's pick it up and put it in the chest. I did get an iron ingot from killing a zombie. I got all sorts of stuff in here. Ooh, I'll take those arrows. And one of these bows, which one is less? Oh, I can make a new bow. Let's do that. Why are we using these crappy zombie bows? Let's make a new bow with our three whole arrows. But you know what? We'll kill some more zombies, get some more arrows. You put the sticks in a line like that. And you're stringing the line like that. And viola, we got a bow. Awesome possum. All right, um, so uh, our garden is coming along just nicely. Do I have a hoe with me? No, I don't. Let's uh, get some bone meal. I'm, I'm not. I'm just crunching up the uh, the wheat. I'm not uh, using my bone meal to make anything grow. Oops, that time I did accidentally. Huh. No seeds. See, that's why I use a hoe, stupid goblin. Stupid, stupid goblin. Alright, I should have took time to come over to my chest and get my hoe. I did not. Wait a minute. While we're out here. We'll do that. This will get us seeds. I know it will. Give me my stone hoe. And hoe it up. Hoe it up like a drunken Friday night. Oh, I'm sorry. I got kids that watch this. Uh, like a gardener. <laughs> no seeds. Well, that's just not right. I don't like that at all. It's like, well, you got fishing now. You don't need seeds. Why do you need seeds, Pullman Goblin? There's some. Alright, so let's go plant those couple of seeds that I got. There's one, and there's one. Um, Alright, all my trees have come into growth, which is good, because we have a new project. I was talking to my older boy, and we don't think there's a very high chance of it. But there's a slim chance that maybe if we put some dirt out here and we threw some grass seed out on it and we got some grass going and we kept it well lit, that maybe, just maybe, a sheep or a cow or a rabbit or a duck or something that we can, can, get, can get, you know, resources out of will appear. So I'm going to build a wooden patio out here, and then I'm going to cover it with some dirt. And uh, we're going to try to make a, a uh, spawning ground for non-hostile creatures like sheep, cows. Sheep would be nice. Um, I also screwed up because while I was in the nether, I realized there's another nether portal down there. I bet you we were supposed to light it. But now, now that I don't have my uh, lava, I am depending on possibly getting a flint and steel drop from a creature. So I've been doing a lot of standing on this pumpkin, looking over the wall at the nighttime, seeing what kind of creatures we got spawning out here. Ah, come on. Uh, see, Paul McGoblin, that guy did blow up. All right. But uh, that's the world. It's looking pretty pretty good. This mega tree is going to drop some apples. I just know it. I'm going to carve that out off camera. 
no one wants to see me spend 10 minutes chopping down this majestic, beautiful oak. But I'm going to do it. All right. Um, so uh, I think I'm going to go offline a little bit and do a little bit of work here. And I will check back with you folks when I have something to show. Morsels, check it out. I was fishing and I got myself a pair of leather boots. I fished a pair of leather boots. Oh, I've got equipment. Let's put them on. Oh, look at that. Paul McGoblin's got a pair of mucks on. Excellent. All right. Um, I've got uh, five regular fish and three three salmon. I'm increasing our food supply. I think that is just wonderful news. Let's see if we have any creatures out here. Hey, spider. Hey, spiders. Come on. Hey, you. Yeah. Come on. All right, more souls. I'll check back in with you in just a little bit. Finishing up the project I'm doing on the other side of the island. All right, more souls. I'm gonna let you watch me fight for a little bit. I open the door. I invite the zombie in. Zombie shy at first. I say, "Come on in." He still doesn't know. Oh, it's because they're fighting to get in. I see. How about a carrot or a potato? Ooh, what do we got? This is from a creeper that I killed from the other side of the wall. But it excites me. Look, I have armor on my little armor section. <laughs> Leather boots. All right. Uh, I was hoping to get something from those zombies there. And uh, going back to uh, waiting on this to become grass, or so yeah, grass, so I can put like tall grass on it. We're we're still hoping that's gonna make uh, some type of other animal. My dirt's just sitting in my chest anyway. Let's put it to a use and run an experiment, see if it works. Our food supply is doing really well. Got a bunch of wheat, 19 wheat, 5 apples, 5 cooked fish. I think I've got some salmon in there now cooking. Yep, they're done. Let's take them off the barbie. Put them in the food chest. Uh, I'm not worried, not worried about going hungry anymore. Alright, uh, still waiting on this to become grass. And uh, I will check in with you again when I have something more to report. All right, morsels, there's a lot of baddies outside my back door. This is going to be a bit of a fight. So, uh, oh, little little zombies getting in. Ah, little zombie is a is a. a <laughs> he's a tough sob, isn't he? Whew. Oh, good. Just in time, there's a creeper out there. I do not want to mess with the creepers. They blow stuff up. I try to lure the creepers over to the corner over here. Ah ha ha! Skeleton Archer killed the creeper for me. <laughs> good Skeleton Archer. There's another one, though. There's another creeper. I saw him. Skeleton Archer, what's in bad? Where are you going to let him? Goodbye, Creeper. Oh, goodbye, Creeper. Whoa, that was a little too close for comfort. All right. So we dispatched those creatures. We get anything cool? Another bone, big deal. Another arrow. Some rotted meat. Nothing very exciting. Some experience, which I haven't really found a use for yet. Unless this 
produces cows. I don't think we will be getting an enchantment table. So uh, we will see how it goes. Uh, but uh, right now it's just kind of just gathering stuff like I normally am. Gather, gather, gather. Replant and gather. Try to build. Alright, I'll check back in with you again in a little while. Morsels, I think that's going to be it. I've been waiting for that grass over there to to get grown and it's just not happening. So I'm going to call it an episode here and continue uh, gathering up materials and growing trees and growing wheat and expanding my little wooden platform out here in the middle of nowhere. Thanks for tuning in and uh, please check out our other videos and like and subscribe uh every little like counts it shows me that you like what i'm doing and please continue doing it um and the final thing i've got to say to you little morsels is stay out of the cooking pot